Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have just launched a five day visibility challenge and this is what I want to show you. I want to show you behind the scenes on how you can put it together in Kartra. Now with Kartra you can't do any free challenges, you can't do anything like that, it, it has to be paid and if you try to do it they'll charge you a pound. So this is one way of getting around it is create a membership site. I have a 30 day visibility but in that visit, I also have a five day and that's my free challenge. So you need to set up a few little things. And I'm just going to show you how I've actually set my challenge up on this. So let me share my screen. Um, so this is the back office of my car trip. Now, what you would need to do, you need to do a few things. You need to set up your membership. So as I say, mine's a 30 day. Let me show you that now. This is where it is. I have in my other one, I have a few free challenges set up, but I'm just going to talk about this one because it can get really complicated. So let me show you into this. So I have set up this um, membership. Now, this is how you can create a free element to your membership. So whoever goes into this, you will be able to see I have a five day and I have a 30 day. So let me show you how I've set that up. So let's go through this. So I'll show you that. Let's just go. Let's just go. Let's just go through the membership bit itself. So this is my 30 day challenge. Now, to get the five days free, they'll only be able to access, obviously, days the home day one, two, three and five. If you then upgrade to the 30 day, you will then get access automatically to the rest of it. So that's that's how your membership will work. For doing a free element to it now you could also add a let's say you could you could drag over another um menu bar on there and you could call it a free something else and you could that could be your free thing and this is how you separate it so let me come out of this now now this is where you will change it so you go save and next save and next it's your access levels. So as you can see, I have 38 of those posts, days one to five, other five day, the rest is the free. So let me just show you how that works. So you go into it. So level one is the five day and you could you can only add four levels. I could add another one and I, then I could call it something else and give certain access to it. So you will see that the five day free challenge, they only have access they have all the same as the 30 days until obviously they get to day six, then they're locked. They can't access any of that. That's how you set up your free element. Now, there's something else you need to do as well before you can make that happen. So let me just save that. I'm gonna save it next. And it's over in the automations tab because what happens I also have this set up in my little form that I've created as well. So I have two set rules on this. So let me just go to this and you can see, and I manually add people through their email who've registered to do the challenge. I manually give them access to the five day challenge. Um, so lead is granted access to this membership for the level five free challenge. Then they go to my list called the August Visibility Challenge. So I know that they came in to do the August Challenge. But then um, whoever automatically goes for the 30 day, they are automatically assigned to the 30 day visibility. So that's that that's you can it's so self-explanatory how to do this. You you just simply do add a new automation. So if lead is let's see, lead is granted access to membership. So I'm going to give them access to the visibility challenge, but I'm only going to give them access to the five day and add. I'm not going to do that now because I'll mess it all up and it took me ages to suss this out. So let's just save all that there. It, you do all that bit in that element of it. Right. So let's go to my products. It's not a product. You won't find it, but you'll, you will find the 30 day because that is a purchasable one. Now. You've got your membership site set up. You've got your five day challenge set up in that. You've allowed access. You've granted access to the free element and you've given access to the full paid element. Now, what you need to do is create a form. 
you need to create and, and gather information on the email address because then they can go into your list called your free challenge list. So you know who's registered for the free challenge. You can then give them access to the challenge that way. So you need to create a form because you're going to then add that email information to your sales page. And this is my sales page. It's unpublished now because they can't get access to it. So I'll just show you how that works. So I gave it a name August. My next one will be October and so on and so forth. And I'll probably just clone it. Um, I don't know how I'm going to work that bit yet, but you just need to create a page and get that um, sign up form dropped into it as well to gather the information that you're going to need. And I'll show you that element to it as well. Right. So this was the challenge that they all signed up with. I had a little countdown. I had a video about it. Sign me up. Yeah, I want to join your challenge. So you would go to edit style and I've just dra dragged over these elements from, the, from the, the menu bar there. Now on link, you are gonna add a pop-up form and that's the pop in the opt-in form that you've already created to gather all that information to join your free challenge. Then whoever goes onto this will then um, get access to the challenge when you do it. So that's how that bit works. Then also I have, obviously, when they've done the, the checks and everything like that, um, I have a thank you for joining the challenge. So I have that page set up as well. Right. So we've done all that. We've created our form. We've created our page. We've created our membership. So now what happens is in your communications bit. So I have a list set up called August Visibility, Visibility Challenge. I've got 56 members on that. So all I did was click on that on the day of the challenge launch. I highlighted all of these names and then I went to action and I went to grant membership. So visibility and I'm giving them membership to the access level that we've set up. They only have access to the five day free challenge. And the minute I move them over to that, they were automatically from Kartra sent the login information. So they could then log in and access day one because I have those dripped as well. So day one releases, day two releases, day three releases, four and five. This throughout, um, I think I've done it throughout actually. Um, everybody gets it a day after sort of thing. So they've got day one and they can get straight on with the task. Right. So what else would you need to know about this? Let me just have a quick look. Um, so let me go back to my forms. Right. This is not this is just something else that you need to be aware of. So let me go to let me find it. August. Let's edit this form. Can you remember where I just showed you before on the membership where the automation? I also have this bit um, set up as well, just in case anything goes. I just like to double check and triple check everything. Um, and that's what you're going to have to do as well, is you're just going to have to sign up with your own email address and see how it works. But it really should work like that. So we've got a double opt-in, um, a confirmation email. Let's go to... Um, Yeah, because that was my five day. Um, thank you for joining. Save and next. Save and next. So the automation part of it. So whoever subscribes to this list, they go to the August vis visibility because I then have control that everybody who signed up to this list, I can on the day of the challenge manually highlight those names, grant them access to the free element of my challenge. Um, and then obviously I do have an email set up who's on the email that, you know, welcome to the challenge. I have another one like, who am I? Just a little bit of information as well, because it's all running a Facebook group. Um, so, yeah, no, I haven't got any advanced automation set up on this. It is actually only all done in the membership. Um, so that's it, basically. Um, that's how you can set up a free challenge for free. 
and get around having to pay a pound and and you know on the products because you can't run any free challenges but that's how it's done you create a page you create a form you gather their emails and then you manually grant them access to your five day challenge um or you can grant them access automatically which i have done for my video training course whoever automatically um but that's a that's a product that's a paid product um and i do have a free masterclass as well and that's how i've set my masterclass up is an email um with a form and once i filled out that form they gave me their email address they go to a welcome page which is my training my free masterclass happy playing with it but that's all it is it's just playing about with it if you do have any questions do you know drop me a comment because i found it really hard at first to grant um to access to create free challenges without having to create you know because you can't create products and stuff so there you go it's all in the email list and manually granting it so i hope that helps um and good luck with um doing any challenges bye